Hi, Yuval. How are you? Uh, just getting back from uh, visiting a customer, uh, doing training with the new model 700B welder. Uh, one of the great things about this welder is now we offer a, a Pelican case, so it's ruggedized, so I can throw it in the back of my pickup truck, or I can ship it on an airplane, and I don't have to worry about the unit getting damaged. Uh, since this is a new unit, you might not have seen it before. Would you like to come in and take a look at it? Come on, follow me. It's also pretty lightweight too to be such a, you know, a ruggedized case. The unit itself, the welder only weighs about eight pounds. So even putting it inside of this case, it's very lightweight and portable. All right, Yuval, so I'm gonna put the unit case up here on the table. And let me show you what's inside. We're really excited about this new welder. Uh, any of you guys that are familiar with our traditional Model 700 welder, uh, we offered it for the better part of 30 years. And we kind of took all that knowledge and used that to build the next generation unit. And this is it. So if I reach inside of here and, and take out the base, this is really kind of the heart and soul of the Model 700B. Uh, looking at the front panel, you've got the on off button, uh, battery indication button. Uh, these are controls to adjust your weld energy setting. This unit, you can vary it anywhere from 10 up to 60 joules. Uh, and at a 30 joule setting, you get about 1500 spot welds out of one battery charge. Uh, these are your connections. This is the ground clamp to connect in the ground clamps. And these two connections are to connect in your handpiece. Also inside of this uh, Pelican case, you've got room for your batteries. Uh, one of the great things about this unit is that it uses a standard Milwaukee M12 battery that you can pick up at your local uh, home improvement store. <clears throat> You've got a little slot here. These could be for extra batteries. In my case, I've got some extra probes that are inside of those little slots. You've got a spot for the charger. This charger is an industry standard Milwaukee for charging uh, M12 batteries. And we've got a version for the United States as well as a version uh, for Europe. You've got a, a pocket here for some additional supplies. These are uh, some extenders that you can use to extend the probe at the end of the, the spot welder. Roughly speaking, this is about three and a half or four inches long. And you can extend the probe out that far in case you're going into some tight uh, spaces. Uh, this is a nylon uh, travel bag. Uh, once you get out to the job site, <clears throat> you might need a, a way to more easily carry this thing. You can toss it into this bag, throw it over your shoulder. It's got a shoulder strap and go crawl around on ladders and things like that and go install uh, the weldable gauges. And then you've got another pocket over here. This is where we've got our handpiece for the unit. There you can see currently it has one of the bent probes on it. There's the trigger. No batteries in it right now, but the batteries would fit here. And then this uh, screw style connector, quarter turn, it's kind of a military style connector would go on the front panel. And then this lug would go on the front panel as well. And then last but not least, you've got your cables for grounding. <clears throat> With this unit, we offer kind of a traditional clamp style of ground. Uh, but we also offer a magnetic style of ground as well. And this magnetic style of ground, if you're out on a large steel structure, trying to figure out how would you put one of these on it, you take this one out, you put it on it, you turn the switch, it essentially becomes a magnet, and there's your ground. So all this is uh, contained, I've kind of taken it out, and now I'm gonna put it back up, but all this can be contained inside of this Pelican case. So you've got a, a nice neat package that's lightweight and very portable so you can carry it with you out into the field in order to install either weldable type strain gauges or maybe you use it for installing thermocouples. Uh, you might also use it for installing thin strips of metal 
Uh, oftentimes we have customers that use nichrome strapping for uh, strain relief for cables and this welder makes a great little instrument or unit uh, for that. Uh, if you'd like to find out more about the Model 700B welder, uh, take a look at our website at www.micro-measurements.com or you can pick up the phone and give us a call at 919-365-3800 and follow the prompts to our Applications Engineering Department and we'd be glad to answer any questions for you about this Model 700B welder. Thank you.